Bobby. She was in the video. I, I, I know. It's very <laughs> This Argentine-Ukrainian family is meeting for the first time. All this time we've been living in Argentina, but we're proud to be Ukrainian. In the Volin region, the guests were presented with bread and salt, a Ukrainian tradition. The Argentines said their families in South America still carry on the customs of their ancestors, especially when it comes to Ukrainian cuisine. <laughs> We eat um, borscht. I cook this, this kind of food for my kids and my grandkids. Um, so my grandmother did touch to my mother, my mother to me, and me to my sons and girl. The meeting was organized by the director of the Manevich Local History Museum. Communication between the Argentine and Ukrainian sides of the family broke in the early 90s. Two months ago, the Argentines inquired with the consulate in their country asking for help in finding their relatives in Ukraine. Researchers drove around villages talking to the locals until, finally, they found the relatives. In 1994, they came to Karasin and met the relatives. After they passed away, there was nobody left who knew anyone here. The children only thought about finding their roots in Ukraine after the parents were gone. Boris and Paraskevia grew up in Ukraine and got married in the village of Karasin in 1920. In the 1930s, they were one of three families in their village who decided to immigrate to Argentina in search of a better life. Their Argentine descendants brought old photographs of their Ukrainian grandparents and a hand-drawn family tree. Boris? Yes? Parasia? Maria? The oldest one? Major. Major. Juan? Horacio. Ana? Nicolás? Angela. Hector? Ivana? The guests, some of whom still bear Ukrainian surnames, were waiting for this moment for three years. That's how long it took them to find their relatives in Ukraine. Today we're very happy to find our Ukrainian family. It's so important to know your roots. And at home we are still trying to maintain Ukrainian traditions, everything that our parents taught us. The Argentines say it will take a lot more time and more than one visit to get acquainted with all of their Ukrainian relatives. There are hundreds of cousins and extended family. If you look back at the years and centuries, our family is bottomless. And if you go forward, it is limitless. The Ukrainian diaspora in Argentina is the seventh largest in the world, with over a quarter of a million people. Most of the Argentine Ukrainians are descendants of immigrants who left Ukraine in the late 19th and early 20th centuries. Most of them speak hardly any Ukrainian, but they cherish their roots and the history of their ancestors. Reported by Ina Duchenko for UATV.